I don't know if you can hear me right now. Let's see. Test, test, test. All right, cool. So, I'm heading to the track right now. It's right there. Just got to run around the block and I felt like I wanted to run around the track. So, here we go. But this is mainly to say to everybody who don't feel like doing anything for themselves that they can do things for themselves. Um, as a dude, I feel like there's a lot of conflicting information out there in regards to what, what you can and can't do as a man. And for me personally, I feel like you should listen to everybody, but then filter what they say you know, based on what's applicable to you in your life. So if what they say is empowering and it's bringing you more joy, more happiness, more wealth, more more um, success in your life, then you should do it and should heed their advice. Um, if they talk about things where it's more like a case by case situation, more personal to them like you know don't don't trust baby mamas or or don't trust your girl or things like that that's more designated to them because they've had problems in the past where the person that they were dealing with was untrustworthy and now they think that everybody's untrustworthy when it came to that so same thing with your hosts or dudes you know Dudes say don't trust girls. Girls say don't trust dudes to a certain degree. So it's honestly like based on a case by case situation. Um, nobody is completely untrustworthy unless they prove themselves to be in all honesty. Everybody has a chance to change their ways, change how they deal with people so one moment the person might be untrustworthy and the next moment they will be trustworthy with the right person or the right situation um depending on their their place in life so don't count anybody out all the time mainly just count yourself in that's what i would tell you so focus on what you want out of your life like the goals um the goals that you have in mind and then look for people especially men who are achieving those goals or have achieved those goals and then see what they say about those things see if what they say is something that you can practice right now and apply to your life and see if those goals are um kind of tainted with their own personal beliefs and opinions and if you see a, a personal belief or opinion that they might be talking about then just erase that from the equation but then but just listen to everything else that they got to say and see if you can apply it to your life. So um, right now I'm in a program where I'm learning skills that I can use for freelancing and ways where I can contribute to the society and the community as a whole and help other people. And as long as the program that I'm in is promoting that and promoting me, learning more, doing more for people, and supporting America, my country, my, my city, my state, whatever it is, my people. As long as the program is promoting that and giving me tools that I can actually apply to right now, then I would say that it's doing its job. So I would say do that with everybody else that you encounter in your life, whether it's a, a program, a book, a lesson, a course, um, school, whatever it is. Just use that same ideal ideology or whatever you want to call it um ideology <laughs> or mindset when it comes to weeding out what's good and what's not good when you're listening to advice um as a dude sometimes it can get tough out there especially when you don't have male role models in your life so that's why i'm creating this video so that other people around can see a, a male or a dude or a guy a man especially a black man who 
is trying to work towards something and wants to get there no matter what. Um, it's okay to strive for things more than what everyone else around you wants. It's okay to want things that you never had before. Um, it's okay to push the envelope and try to do new things in your life as long as you're working towards your goals that's okay as long as you're not hurting anybody in the process that's okay um just don't give up and when it gets hard just keep looking keep asking around seeing who's doing things in their life that are inspirational to you things that are motivating to you things that are along the same lines as what you want to do in your life and go after those people see what they're doing see what they're reading see what they're learning see what kind of crowds they spend their time in people they surround themselves with um those types of things just look for what you want out of life as opposed to what you don't want out of life and nine times out of ten you're gonna find what you want as long as you keep that tunnel vision on what you want you'll eventually get there so that's my little quick video today i'm about to go get this run on get a little workout in uh catch y'all later